Medellin Governor Peter Yama explained to the people of Rye Coast that the spill has now led to the contamination of marine life in Medellin waters. Yama's claim is based on the findings of Swiss scientist Dr. Alex Mozon, who had gathered samples from the impacted area and carried out testing. <laughs> Locals say they are afraid to go out fishing or swim in the sea due to contamination fears and are supporting the call made by the Medellin provincial government to shut down the mine. All man we are all, only, only kissing fish, na, only making livelihood long, 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 So, people of the people, you know, I'm a mass, uh, mining activity work, lo, come up, lo, hap. Na, all no look out in mall. Refinery system wrong on now. Now spill it come up now. Bagger up you come up long planting man Mary Loras because especially all coastal people. So this plan I mean making me plan, you know, among us. Government or the company has to reason as to why I have to lose my life on top of the salt water. Another local is questioning SEPA's investigation and its findings, saying the reports presented by SEPA is too shallow to believe as the truth. Jeffrey Lasson said the people of Rikos wants more than three investigations to be carried out on Medellin waters and marine life to determine the cause of fish dying. When you send me looking at the mine, kind of spillets have come up. Investigation, all the findings all come up in Pinis law mine, kind of Tupla report come outside. M no, M no come one kind. Medellin Governor Peter Yama says Ramu Nicol is yet to develop Rye Coast, saying it has lied to the people of Usinobundi and Rye Coast districts since the company's inception. Matha Luis, National MTV News, Medellin.